So in LabVIEW, you have several options for performing searches. One of the option that is available in the widest possible locations is the application wide search. This is available in the getting started window, the, the, the window that opens when you launch, it, launch the lab view. It is also available if you launch a VI, it's available from the front panel as well as from the block diagram. This search can also, if you have, if you are using a localized version of LabVIEW, then your searches can be performed, can return uh, in your local language as well as in English. If you click on this arrow, then the search will minimize both on front panel and on the block diagram clicking it again expands it so to do a search the search is incremental just type your word and when you will see the search results this application wide search facility searches through the lab view help file the icon this icon shows you that this help is from the lab view help if you are on the block diagram you will see this icon which will show you that this help is coming from the functions palette if you are on the front panel then you see an icon like this which shows you that this help is from the functions palette but if you are in the getting started window then you will not see the help from the palette since you are not in a VI and the palettes do not apply Furthermore, you can put your search string in quotation marks, but in that case, you will not get any palette results. Quotation marks specify that you want exact matches further you can also search online if you click and I support community support downloads or product information let's click here searching please wait for these you need an active internet connection and when you are searching for online this globe will show you that you are not doing a local search but the search is um, online and if you press this button uh, the browser page will open and if you are doing a palette search, you can do drop. If you press this drop, and LabVIEW will stick the function to your mouse cursor. And you can place it on your block diagram. And if you click on this find option, then LabVIEW will open the palette and show you where that function is located. And if you press the help option, have you will open its regular help and you can read detailed help for the selected function
likewise if you press open for internet based help your browser will default browser will launch and the help for online help will appear in the browser Moreover, you can customize your help by going to Tools menu and then Options. And when the Options menu launches, from the Category section, you can go to Search. And there you will find all the options where you can to perform the search um, if you select help then search is the help you have installed on your system and also note that uh, the search results for the help category may not include help for all LabVIEW modules and toolkits and products outside of LabVIEW you can perform palette searches and I help manuals and tutorials on ni.com and community support and the download searches etc or and also if you have selected one particular help and you want to move it up or down you can use these two uh, buttons you can enable or disable the relevant searches from this option Further, you can also, if you want to limit your search to a particular category, you can press this button and only that particular category shows. You can also move to the next 10 pages of help or you can go to the last one, the first one. And also you can collapse this uh, help and go back to the uh, uh, total help um, if you want to. Further, if you move your mouse over a particular item or you can use the keyboard uh, arrow keys, you can also press enter to launch that option. For example, in this option, you, uh, in this particular selection, you have three options, drop, find and help. But drop is highlighted. So if I press enter, the lab view will stick the selected function and I can place it on the block diagram. So this, way, this is all uh, about searching the global search facility in lab view. I hope this helped you in your programming and thanks for watching.